Okay, uh, so I mentioned in, a in my previous video how these cheap uh, drugstore padlocks are very, very uh, easy to use some old bypass techniques, which uh, most of the manufacturers who actually put their names on things have tried to engineer away. So here we have a Peterson knife tool. It's just a very simple little spike or probe. Uh, pretty thin, but uh, and quite pointy. So you do want to be careful if you ever poke yourself, because that that will that is usually sharp enough to uh, cause a bit of an injury. Now it's fairly flexible, but it's not really any more flexible than a standard width pick. Now, and then this isn't a pick. This is a bypass tool. Uh, so really, what you do is you just slide it in here, push the pins out of the way, and you're just feeling around in the back, there you go, for uh, the interior uh, part of the latch, which actually is what holds this closed. If you can just see in there, I'm gonna pull this out so I can use it to point, this piece right here, which Hopefully you can see moving around in there as I poke it. That's the latch. And on the inside of this lock, it has a sort of U-shape that the back of this uh, cylinder engages with. And when the cylinder turns, it has a little sort of cam on the back that pushes uh, this into the uh, body of the lock away from this little cutout, which is what it engages with and keeps the shackle closed. So this is on older uh, or poorly designed locks which don't have a shield on the back of the uh, cylinder uh, is still effective at least on these drugstore copies. So it's also just a useful uh, tool as a probe or as a way to test other things. That's uh, it for now and hopefully uh, pretty soon I'll be able to get you some, uh, some videos of something at least a little bit more impressive. So, happy picking.